फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू एपी टॉगर्स अनबॉक्स चैनल आई एम बैक विथ वन मोर एक्सपेरिमेंट यूजिंग आर्डिनो मेगा बोर्ड सो टुडे आई विल शो यू डेमोन्स्ट्रेशन ऑफ टॉप बैक टॉक बैक एप्लीकेशन फ्रॉम थिंग स्पिक सर्वर सो बेसिकली आई विल शो यू हाउ यू कैन कंट्रोल वल एल ई डी यूजिंग टॉक बैक एप्लीकेशन फ्रॉम थिंग स्पिक सर्वर सो आर आर्डिनो मेगा बोर्ड विल ट्राई टू कनेक्ट टू थिंग स्पिक सर्वर and using one api and based on the command line uh, means whatever command we have uh, decided there our led will be controlled controlling led is just an example you but we can do many more things in the same way so this is the program you can see and here uh, we will be controlling led using talkback application and to connect to internet Uh, we will be using ESP zero one Wi-Fi module, and these are the physical connections we are going to make. The LED is going to connect. We will connect LED to pin number thirteen, and this is pin diagram for ESP zero one module. These are the connections for ESP zero one module, and these are the steps we are going to follow for this for this demonstration. Okay, and uh, what will be the outcome of, outcome of the program? so our led will blink with specific interval and uh, whatever uh, back end uh, command will be happening at the same time we will see that using serial monitor okay so first of all we need to create one account on things things pick server and we have to these follow these three steps then we have to make all the connection we have to connect arduino mega board uh, to the to our laptop using usb cable and we need to make these changes we need to make these values in this program and once that is done then this program is ready to run okay so i'll show you first of all these are the connections you can see this is esp01 module this is led we are connecting this led through one register and these are the connections all the connections i have written over there you can find it and this program will be available to download in the description of this video so basically first of all we'll go to thingspeak server i have already logged in uh so you have to sign up first time for very first time then you can log in and you can use it so go to apps then go to talkback then create new talkback i have already created two but i'll show you create new talkback Give any name, so I'll give IoT Talk Back. Okay, you don't have to change anything here. Then add new command. I'll give one. Then LED on position two. LED off. Whatever command you will provide here. you have to make these changes in the code also so i am giving led on and led off uh, you can check wherever i have written led on and led off in the program if you give some other name you have to change that name in the program also okay oh sorry so i have to make one led on second led off okay then you have to click on save talk back once that is done you can see uh, two commands i have given two commands led on and led off these are two command ids for that right now once that is done you have to make this three these changes you have to check that you have one talkback id you have an api key and you have to use two command ids so you have to copy all these four things and paste it in the program and out of all these apis post gate put and all those thing we will be using this gate api okay so you can see here in this api 20951 this is talkback id whatever this command id dot json is written over here at this place we will put this id or this id and we will not write dot json we will write only id so that we will get one value if we write dot json the output will be in the form of json we don't want that right now and after this api key equal to whatever this is it is this api key okay so copy these four things 
थ्री एंड फोर एंड पेस्ट इट देर सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल आई विल राइट कॉपी दिस ए पी आई की देन यू कैन सी यू हैव टू रिप्लेस दिस थिंग्स दिस इज द फॉर्मेट हियर टॉप बैक आई डी देन कमांड आई डी एंड देन हियर ए पी आई की and other than that we have to change ssid and password ssid means wifi name so in this code i have written all the comments here you can it will be easy to understand i'll explain it one more time so see here 20941 is talkback id this is command id and this one is my api key i'm not going to change it I have just shown you how you can create. I can show you that. See here, two zero nine four one. This is my talk talkback ID. This is my API key, and these two are my command IDs. Okay, so one. This is API key. This is uh, my talkback ID, and this is my command ID. So you have to make these changes. and similarly in this code you have to make these changes here you have to put your wifi name and your wifi password okay here so in this code what i have done that uh, first of all i have made uh, written the program for getting led on command from the cloud so this is the code it is very similar to our previous code once we receive see here we are receiving data from the cloud and uh, whatever response we get that response will be printed or serial serial monitor here and we will check in that response whether led on is available or not if you have, you have written some other command name here whatever the command name are here you have to put it you have to put it here okay led on if led on is present inside that received mess response or message then our led should will be turn will be on and exactly same code i have copied i have uh, just copied and pasted here just made one change that uh, whatever command id is here this is for led off that means this command id and you have to search for led off here okay everything is same and then once we find led off in received message that means at the time we will turn off our led so that's it i'm connecting my usb port okay you have to set this 9600 and both nl and cr option Okay, I'm going to upload this. It's uploading right now. You can observe here. Uploading is done. These are the connections. You can see. It is connected to Wi-Fi. Then we have sent a send one request. See, we got the response. we got three lines in the response we received 67 bytes then send okay and then that final last line it searched whether led on is available there it was there that's why our led was on now in second response we got led off so it is off now wait for one some more time see we got led on response there so led is on this is just a demo using one led but we can write many more commands and we can control many more app things many more ios using same by the same way okay so that's it from my end in my next video i will show 
I'll demonstrate you the same application using node MCU so I think you understood this okay so thank you guys for watching this video and just just like I told you this program will be available for you to download and it will be given in the description and if you like this video just click on like button if you don't then click on dislike button if any you have any doubt or something you can post it in the comment box and if you like some if you want to watch some of these videos some more videos like this subscribe this channel thank you very much this is Akshay Daga signing off